Hello and welcome to another Tactical Thursday. My name is Daniel Olstead and I'm the Academy Director for River City FC. On today's Tactical Thursday, we're going to be discussing the build outline. The build outline was introduced by US Soccer a few years ago in both the 4v4 and 7v7 formatted games. Along with not allowing goalkeepers to punt in the 7v7 games, the build outline is meant to encourage teams to move the ball upfield through passing and moving, thus aiding in overall player development. By not allowing goalkeepers at this age to punt the ball upfield, there is more reliance on technical execution rather than pure athleticism. In our example on the right, the yellow team is attacking our goal. The striker gets a shot on goal, and our goalkeeper makes the save. At this point, the opponent is required to leave that area and go set themselves up behind the build out line. This then allows our team to get ready to build up and try to move the ball upfield. Once the goalkeeper puts the ball back into play, the opponent is able to re-enter the field. Now our team must look to build out by using passing and moving rather than possibly one clearance from the goalkeeper that goes directly up the field. In our example video that's going to follow, you'll see our 2011 boys team using the build out line and building up, leading to a goal through clever passing and moving. 